Hello everybody, this is Max Farrell from Panther Kempo, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the gi on for adults and sort of kind of processes over to kids as well. So when you get receive your gi, you'll receive it nice and folded. So of course you're gonna unfold it. The first thing I always tell people is put on the pants first, right? You wanna get your pants on first. Now when the pants come, they come, uh, if, if it's for a kid, it might be a little bit bigger, so we're gonna have to roll up the cuffs, okay? Back down in the day, like when you were, you were a kid, you rolled up your sleeves, rolled up your pant cuffs, completely okay. You kind of get it a little bit bigger so they can grow in it so it lasts a little bit longer. Um, all the geese will have an elastic waistband and a little tie front. Now, unlike some pants where they would tie in, in the actual front right there, these are gonna tie inside, and then you'll tuck that string in. Now, we usually wear shorts or underwear underneath, of course. Uh, keep in mind that um, hygiene is an importance, of course, just like anybody else. Put your, put your pants on one leg at a time. If you jump in with both feet, you might end up getting in a little trouble, okay? So very simple. You can tuck in your shirt, or you can leave it untucked, completely up to you on preference. I like mine untucked. And when we do the internal string, we don't want to tie it so it's super tight unless the pants are very, 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 very big. And then you can pull a little, put a little tension on, but not too much. Shouldn't cut off circulation, should fit nice and snug. And if not, we can get you a bigger pair or a smaller pair from that point. But keep in mind, if we go smaller, you're going to have um, fitting issues. If you're an adult, you're probably already grown. Um, we can always take these to a tailor and get them hemmed or get them fitted properly at that point as well. Now, the gi top is a little bit unusual. Now the gi top should have several little different ties, some on the outside, some on the inside. You have a tie on the lapel, you have a tie in the mid crease that's right here, and then on the other side you have it as well on the outside and on the inside. If you don't have one of those tabs or if one got ripped off, we can just get a piece of cloth uh, or a piece of, um, piece of this fabric material like this. If it does get ripped off, it can be sewed on very easily. Uh, so no worries. So we're gonna don our coat. Now again, with the sleeves, if you're an adult and it's too long or it's too short, it's all the way up here, uh, I'm not sure what happened. We, I'm pretty good at fitting people with the coat, with the jackets, uh, with the geese. So make sure that it's nice and uh, fitted properly. And if it's for a child, roll up the sleeves. They're gonna grow into it. There'll be a time when this thing will fit really, really good. So, okay. So now that we got the gi top on, I'm going to, I'm basically gonna go with my, my left is gonna go over my right, okay? So this is my right side. I'm going to take my right hand and find the outside tassel, okay? And now I'm looking for the inside tassel over on my left side. I'm gonna grab it and I'm gonna marry these two together. Now I'm just gonna use a simple little box bow knot, just like that. Very, very super simple. You know, black on black on black. I don't know why I thought about this, but you can kind of see it's just a nice little bow knot right there. I make sure that my lapel is pulled over. It's not to be super, super tight. This is only supposed to fasten and to try to help keep it from bunching up or unfurling. Now, I'm gonna take this left-hand side and I'm gonna find my right-hand tassel right here. And I'm gonna tie these two together. Again, another little bow, not from that point. So from here, I should have a nice straight gi. If it's too long or it's too short, again, we can talk about process, raise your hands up, put your hands down, get your feet up. So this is a brand new black gi represented here, left to the right. So now let's talk about tying your belt. 